Rapids Nation, we are joined by someone who's no stranger if you're a fan of the game. Now, this guy used to kill us every time he came to town. So what do you do when that happens? Well, you go out and you trade for him and you bring him in. Ethan Stuck was joining us today. How are you doing? Good. How are you? Awesome. So uh, a couple of weeks of quarantine and, uh, and you're into the games now. How are things going so far? Uh, it's been pretty good so far. I haven't skated. Uh, it's been a month and a half now, so it was good to get back on the ice last week. Yeah. Starting to get the rust off here now and... Uh, Excited for this weekend. Awesome. So when you heard you were coming to Grand Falls, what were your thoughts on that? I was really excited. I saw the team was doing really well this year and uh, brought in a lot of new guys and stuff. And, uh, yeah, I was just really excited. I love the small town feel. And, uh, yeah, I wanted to play for the organization. So, Who was the first guy that came up to you when you came into the dressing room? Uh, it'd probably be uh, Julian Jacobs. Okay. It'd probably be him. Yeah. I thought Nolan Boyd might be coming up and giving you a big hug. Cause <laughs> <laughs> so, good stuff. So, a couple of games, uh, a couple of games in, you uh, took on well Fredericton over the weekend. There, uh, how was that playing against your old team? Uh, I was good. You know, uh, trying to get the jitters off, of course, and uh, get get back into the uh, the rhythm of things. And uh, yeah, it was it was pretty good first weekend. So, even though we had two losses, I, I think. Uh, our team played well, and uh, we got some stuff to fix, but we're going to be ready to go for this weekend. Hey, guys have been practicing hard this week and, yeah. and ready to go. So back-to-back again against uh, Miramichi and Fredericton again. Yep. So pretty uh, pretty good. Looking forward to a better outcome of this one. Yeah, for sure. Awesome. What do you think the, the gel of the team is now? There's been, a, obviously, a couple of additions to the team. And uh, so what's it look like now in the dressing room? Uh, you know, the boys all love each other. Like, we got a great group of guys down there, and everybody gets along, and everybody's always hanging out. So... It's a really fun time, and it's all the boys love each other, so it's really good. Awesome. What do you think is going to happen for the rest of the season here? A lot of back-to-back games and a pretty tight schedule, so yeah, it's definitely going to be squeezed. But uh, you know, like like you're saying, just then we got a great group of guys, so uh, it's going to be a fun ride. So. Awesome. Good stuff. All right. So, what should the fans know about you? What's what's one thing that they might not know that you want them to know about? Uh, I don't know. I'd say I'm a pretty big shooter on the ice. I like to I like to score and pretty uh pretty loud with my emotions on the ice when i score and stuff so okay just a, i would say a loud personality on the ice okay perfect so kind of in keeping with the rest of the the guys from the rock there right you got your yeah. brother there now and of course nick abbott who's loud at any time yeah but uh how's that working out with the three in the dressing room with oh, everybody awesome. else you know uh, a lot of guys will learn a lot of new fee slang and stuff so uh <laughs> definitely a change up for him so Awesome. Well, good luck. Welcome to town, and uh, we look forward to seeing you on the ice and, uh, and talking again further in this, the rest of the season here. Thank you very much.